ghosts and ghouls from one and all who laugh and shriek up and down the halls. On this glorious day in October, we shall steal the souls all over. This is Three Scary Games. Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude, Chris, from YouTube, and welcome back to another three scary games. It's the first three scary games of October, and definitely not the last. This first one here, we have a game called Something in the Well. I don't know anything about this game. I know that this has two endings. This and one of the other games that I have on my list both have two endings. We're gonna try to get them both, but I am by no means a completionist. Um, nothing to be said. I, I got my lights decorated in like a, a, a Halloween October theme. You know, we got green and orange and then orange and green. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to switch it up. I might keep them like this all October. Like every video that I do in October, these are going to be the lights from now on. Those are going to be what my lights look like. But without further ado, <laughs> let's hop right into this shit. God damn. Oh, uh, this is going to be scary as fuck. Look at the... Look at the way that this game looks. <laughs> oh no. I'm not going out there. Fair enough. I wouldn't want to go outside and the... turn that off. We're going to get some kind of demons coming through. Oh, okay. Oh, it's a dog. She's asleep. I need you to wake up. This is, oh. Why? Why? Okay. Uh. My dog's barking. My dog's a bork barking. Why are you bork barking, girl? That looks like a face. Why are you bork barking, girl? Uh, she's barking at the door. Oh my gosh. Are there lights for this room? I can see outside too. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gonna die. What is it, girl? Something's got her worked up. Um, I'm not going out there. Yeah, okay, cool. So, if that's the case, then I'm not going out there. Ah, what's happening? Why do I have night vision now? Am I actually going outside? Am I actually going to attempt to go outside? Oh, shit. Fuck me. Can we not? Let me powers out. Ah! All right, I'm not going out through the door that they expect me to go out of. That's how they get you. They think that you're gonna go out of the way that they made clearly obvious that you should go, but I'm not doing that. I'm gonna mm, mm. just get in the car. Just get in the car and leave. I can't leave without Molly. Oh fuck! No, I I wouldn't leave without my own dog, and I shouldn't expect a video game character to leave without theirs. Molly! I can't whistle right now. Whistling is a skill that I have that comes and goes. See, I can barely whistle as it is. Molly! Bork once if you can hear me. Bork twice if no. What? Why am I breathing so heavy? Why am I breathing so heavy? Molly! I'll give you a treat. Oh, no. No. Don't make me go out there. Here we go. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. That's my impression of a whistle. I'm so tense. Oh, it's the well. The well. Okay, it's the well. Molly's collar. Ah! Ah! Why would I go down here? Why would I go down? I'm so sorry, but a I'm so sorry. But a dog is not worth going down a well for. Oh, you've got to be shitting me. Oh my god. The water's getting deeper. Either the water's getting deeper or I'm getting... I thought I heard footsteps. Oh my god. Either the water's getting deeper or I'm getting shorter. Or I'm just... I'm just tripping. What the fuck? 
Huh? Why is there just a church in the middle of the woods? Who's coming out here? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. Who's coming out here on a Sunday? Molly! I have some Scooby snacks for you. I know they're your favorite. I can hear her tail wagging. Okay, my thing though is like, if somebody did want to like, how does Molly fit into all this? <laughs> That's kind of a dumb question, right? But like, how does she fit into this? Why would they kidnap a dog? Were they, maybe they knew that I was like actually gonna go for her. Maybe they knew. So they just wanted to get me out of the house. Today, we gather here to honor our Lord and Savior. Um, I can't interact with anything. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is no church that I'd wanna, that I'd wanna service for. Um, Be prepared, be prepared, be prepared, be prepared. All right, well, she's dead. She's dead. That's all we need to know. Molly's gone. End of story. We can go home now, right? Oh, okay. Wow. Wow. What do I do? What do I do? I'm running! I'm running! I'm running! I'm running! I'm running! What am I running away from? Am I just running just to run? Because I can do that. You know, I'm black. Black people will run just to run. I'll run because I see a whole group of people running. I don't need a reason. I'll run! I'm running! Oh my god. I don't even know what I'm running from. Oh! 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 I see. I see. Can't move. No bodies were ever found. Police discovered camcorder footage on 21-7-1983, but damage to the tape rendered it useless. The footage was never released to the public. Okay, so I guess the second ending is that you have to survive. Wow. All right, I'm gonna give it another try. I'm gonna try to survive this time. I saw it move. I saw it kind of like, you know, creep up, but I wasn't expecting it to run at me. With the knowledge that I know now, Knowing that my dog is not gonna make it, right? <laughs> Knowing that she's gonna die. Is there really any reason for me to... Is there any any reason for me to stay for her? You know what I mean? Like, I know she's gonna die. You need to leave. You know, curiosity killed the cat, but I never expected it to be so true for the dog. I don't think I'm gonna get the second ending on the first try though. Well, technically this will be my second try, but this will be first try trying to get the alternate ending so that's what i mean does that make sense oh what is this one out of five dog what wait what oh will this help me get the second ending if i find dog statues would i be able to Ooh, i'm curious now i'm peaked my interest is peaked let me find these dog statues Ah, two dog statues. Interesting. Okay. So do I find them all in the same area? I don't think so, because I've looped around the house about two times already. Why are you breathing so heavy? Get some exercise. Damn, I'm only holding the sprint button for like five seconds before you start sprint or uh, huffing and puffing. Three dog statues. Nice. Have video games turned me into a completionist? Is this Is this what it's like? Okay, I don't think the rest of them I can find elsewhere. I have to go into the well, I think, to find the last two. At least I hope. I hope that's the case. I'm gonna go this way. Okay. Bop. Sweet. Give me the last one and I'll be out of your hair for good. 
No! No! I need that dog statue. I'm hoping that the last one I need is in the woods somewhere here. Were these dog statues here the first time? Like, was this something that I just missed or did it unlock, like, since I finished the game? I can only assume that the next statue that I need is inside the church. Right here in between the seats. Ah, there we go. Five statues collected. So now what? Do I get a different ending? What if I were to just leave? All right, whatever. Molly, oh no! She's dead! Molly! No! My sweet girl! I'm gonna kill whoever did this to you! No! I'm gonna kill you, you bitch! You bastard! You killed my dog! Okay, where am I going? Do I just take the straight path? Wait, I'm not being chased anymore. <gasps> Wait, I'm not being chased anymore. What the fuck? <laughs> what the hell? Okay, I've been abducted by dogs. Hey! Bark, bark! You're safe from the Atash, Atash, okay. What? I was placed diagonally from that other dog, so it'd be harder to notice we use the same 3D models. What? Hey, buddy! Molly! Molly, you're safe! Thank you for always taking care of me, human. Now it's my turn to take care of you. Off to the stars we go, Molly. <laughs> what the fuck? Is there anything that I can do? We're going to the dog planet. Huh? Didn't work though, did it? Apologies for my odor. There's no shower aboard. You don't smell much better, you know. Fuck you then! At least I can shower myself. In fact, the only ancient horror beyond human comprehension in this game is your smell. I'm getting roasted by a fucking dog. Hey buddy, apologies, okay. I wanna see all the lines of dialogue. The trip will take seven days or one human day. Yeah, our ship is a little sparse, but what did you expect from a five minute long indie horror game? You're safe, okay. What do you want? What? I don't have anything to say. No, really. Why do you keep trying to talk to me? Do you think this is real life too? Weirdo. Or do you do this in real life? What? Huh? Okay. I was placed diagonally. Didn't work though. Okay. Molly! Wow. Talk to me again when you're ready to go. I think I'm ready. Let's go. Off into the cosmos. And then you all flew to the dog planet and you lived happily ever after. The end. Okay. I'm gonna take that as the second ending. I... I don't know if that was a secret ending and there's still another one that I have left to get. I'm not gonna try and figure it out because I've already been recording for 23 minutes on just one game. So, uh, the next game. Our next game is called Tiki Tiki Moonlit Dread. I don't know why I had an accent at the end of that. It's just the Tiki Tiki really gets me. Welcome to Squidward's Tiki Land. That's, that's what I thought of when I downloaded this game. Uh, Tiki Tiki Moonlit Dread. Again, no clue what this game is about. I try to avoid all that stuff when downloading these games so that I'm completely surprised as to what I'm getting myself into. Uh, let's hop right into this shit!
Done. Oh, Lord. Am I coding or am I on Reddit? What's this? Read. Mysterious brutal incident. Man found cut in half with no clues. October 5th, 2023. That's today. 8.30 p.m. Asahi... Asahi Kawa, Japan. A man was found with his body cut in half near the station area of Asihaki... Asa... <laughs> Asahi Kawa. Asahi Kawa? Am I saying this right? In a shocking incident that has bef baffled the police. The crime scene was discovered by a passerby who heard a strange noise last Friday night. The victim looked like he was chopped by an axe and blood was everywhere. The police sealed off the scene and investigated, but they have not found any clues, witnesses, or witnesses that could have explained that could explain. What happened? Some people have suggested that this incident may be linked to the urban legend of Tiki Tiki, a ghost of, of a woman who was cut in half by a train and now haunts the station areas. She moves by dragging her upper body with her hands, making the Tiki Tiki sound and cuts anyone who sees her in half with a scythe or a sick. However, the police have not confirmed this rumor and are still searching for the truth. They have asked the public to stay calm and alert and to report any suspicious activity or information to them. Related articles. Is the urban legend Tiki Tiki rumor related to the incident? What is the truth? Resident of Ahaz uh, Asahaha <laughs> City <laughs> are terrified. Debate rages in about on about the relationship between the incident and Tiki Tiki. This is unbelievable. How could this happen? Reminder, get groceries. Oh shit. I almost forgot to pick up some groceries. Nah, just just Uber Eats. DoorDash it. We don't need to go outside after reading that. Come on now. Press tab to see hide. Okay. So. Alright. So we need two cartons of milk. For what? We're one person. I can't even get through half a gallon of milk by myself. One olive oil, one white rice, two instant ramen, one cereal, one tea bags. <laughs> Is this like a box of tea bags or just a singular tea bag? I'm very confused as to what this list is. One dish soap. Am I a college student? What the fuck is this list? I got a donut and some Pepsi. I'm definitely a college student. Here we go. Off to the store. You know what that sounds like to me? Sounds like I should be back in the house. Oh, I was like, where's the fucking train? Uh, okay, I can't go this way. Can't go into the street either. Wait, never mind. Yes, I can. Cool. All right. I have a stamina bar that slowly refills. Very slowly. It's good to know that I live so close to the, the grocery store, though. Okay. I just jacked this guy's car. Uh, 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 I've been practicing Japanese. Hold on, I got you. Konnichiwa. Oh, shit. Oh, she's just a sweet old lady. She's just a sweet old lady. What's good, Granny? All right. Uh, so let's look at the list. So we need two milk. Where'd the milk be at? Do we have a problem? Do we have a problem? What's good? What's good? Square up. What's good? These hands are ready to eat for everyone. Young and old. Okay, why is she just following me like that? You won't follow me into the bathroom. Okay, I think she will. Um, um. Why are you following me? At night, the old woman's tales come true. Run, young man. Okay. Um. Cool. Grab olive oil. Where'd the milk be at, though? Grab snacks. Instant ramen. But where'd the milk be at? 
I just want some milk. Grab cereal. It's a good thing I don't have a kid. Grab the milk and never come back. <gasps> That's what happens. I probably do have a son. I probably do have a son or a daughter. I probably do have a child. I'm grabbing the milk and I'm not coming back. <laughs> not because I didn't want to, but because, but because I got kidnapped. It all comes together now. It's because I died and nobody was there to report my death. Where's the fucking milk? Good evening, young one. Have you heard about the Tiki Tiki incident? Hey, I want to be in on this conversation. Tiki Tiki, you mean that urban legend? Yes, exactly. You're young, so maybe you're not aware. But it seems that legend has turned into reality lately. It absolutely terrified. It's absolutely terrifying. Wait, really? What happened? Tonight, right here in this town. If she appears, you won't escape her grasp. Be careful, young one. Be careful. Uh, yeah, I'll be more careful. Oh, she's ringing up her shit. Thanks for the scary stories. Oh, tea bag. So I guess I gotta look really close for these sparkles. White race. I swear if the milk is anywhere but in the fridge, I'm gonna have a I'm gonna throw like hands. I'm gonna riot. Because there's no reason why your milk should be anywhere but in the fridge. That's a safety hazard. No fucking way! Lady! Hey! Hey! Excuse me! I need to speak to the manager! Cause why is your milk anywhere but in the fridge? Ha! Lady? Ma'am? She dipped. <laughs> After the old lady told her the scary story, she's gone. She left out. Can I take a piss? So I don't piss myself on the way home? Alright, I guess it's free then. <laughs> I need to find the cashier to settle my bill. No! No, you don't! You really don't! It's not that serious! I'm good. She wasn't there to do her job, so therefore... I take what I, I take what I came to get. Simple as that. That's the one of two endings. I just jack the shit, go home. I need to settle my bill before going home. No, you don't! Oh. What part of the store is this? Okay, there she is. Can I climb up the ladder? I cannot. I lied. Ma'am. I don't wanna, Ma'am, mm. ma'am. Ma Excuse me, ma'am, I have to settle my bill with you. Oh, what are you doing here? I'm sorry, I came here to settle my bill. Even though it's really not that serious. I see. Wait here for a moment, I'll be back. So please return to the store and wait there. Alright, I'm going back. Uh, okay. I don't think I want to. I think, can't you just like, can't you just stop what you're doing real quick and, you know, come to the, come to the cash register? Ah! Why does everything have to be so fucking loud? Ma'am, did you hear that? Are you not gonna go investigate? You're gonna leave that up to me? Like, we... We can tag team this! I don't need to be investigating shit by myself. Okay. Okay. Okay, so what I'm not gonna say anything about this. I'm just gonna look and go about my merry way This has no importance to me That could have been me instead of the light post Ma'am Miss oh, yeah, I completely forgot I have a fucking score to settle with you not a bill I have a score to settle. Why is your milk sitting out without being refrigerated this this is not a refrigerated area Huh? 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 Answer me! Answer me, bitch! Good evening. I'd like to pay. Oh, that's me. Good evening. Gumbawa. Hello? Oh, okay, sure. Your total would be 2,750 yen, please. Excuse me, what's wrong with that old lady? Oh, that old lady is a bit unusual, I think. At night, she often tells strange stories. Strange stories at night? 
Here's your change. Night, 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 night. Is that car still out there? Uh, I'm locked in. I'm locked in. Ma'am? Ma'am, I'm locked in. What the hell is that? A train ticket. No, I don't think I... Nope. I don't think I want it. Ma'am! Oh. Oh. Okay. Um. Um. Oh my god, it's dark as fuck. What is the clapping? Are you slapping your meat? I'm not scared! I'm not a little bitch! Come at me! Come get me! Come get me! What the fuck am I supposed to do? Ah! Okay! Reminder, hold shift to run. Well, I kinda need more stamina. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. This is where I die. This is how it ends. No, I'm good. It's all good. Everything's there, okay. See, I should have already been home. I should have already been at home. Because the groceries aren't worth it. The groceries aren't worth it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. How do you get the second ending? How? Looks like it looks like you have finished one of the endings. Uh, would you like to continue from the last checkpoint or start from the beginning? Continue. So I have a theory, right? I have a theory because up until the point that I started running, she wasn't chasing me. So I think. Here's my theory. She's just jealous that she doesn't have legs to run. Even though that's a speedy bitch, right? She was. Right? She was moving. So I'm thinking if I just walk to my house and not run, she won't kill me. Right. Okay. So that's where my theory comes into play because she got she got got because she was running so i think that you can survive if you don't run and the game tries to remind you that you can run so that it gets you that's how it gets you if you just walk if you just go about your merry way you're good she has no reason to you have nothing to worry about because she should i think in her mind she's the only one who should be a speedy bitch, right nobody else is allowed to run but me, it's her thought process, right? I think I got this in the bag. What? What? <laughs> oh. My theory was incorrect. So do I have to run at like the last second? Like I walk my entire way there, but then I run as soon as I get like really close to the house. I don't know. How am I supposed to get there? So what if I just start running off rip? I'm not gonna have enough stamina to make it to my house. She can't get me. She can't get me. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Can I juke her? What if I juke her? <laughs> can I take the car? I can't jack the car. There's got to be something that I can do. I don't think going straight home is the answer. Something's glowing over here. What is this? <gasps> A car key. Oh, let's go. 
Let's go. That's how we get the second ending. We just need to get to the car and then we're home free. Let's go. Whoa. Can't cut me in half if I'm in a car, bitch. And if you try, I'll run you over. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Survived. We did it. Did it. I'm him. What can I say? I survived. No more of the tiki tiki. Let's go. Cause I was like, I should be able to, I should be able to jack the car. And I think that's what happened. I think the car that crashed into the light post, they probably saw the girl out in the street and like, and then uh, they got out to check and make sure that she was okay or whatever. And then that's how she got, they, they got got, right? I'm a genius. A next game. This game contains jump scares, loud noises, blood, violence, and gore. How loud are these noises? For a better experience, use headphones, turn up the volume, play in the dark. Um, I think if I were to play in the dark, it'd be a little hard to see me. This is our last game of the three scary games. This is the Smiling Man uh, remake. I don't know what the original one is. I don't know because it's based off of a creepy pasta. So I don't know if the creepy pasta is supposed to be the original and this is like the remake of the original story. I don't know. I'm going to try to get it as dark as possible in here, though, without making it impossible to see me. So give me one second. There we go. You know, I can't turn the light all the way off, but like I can I can at least dim it a little bit. Give it that dark atmosphere. Yes, sir. And then you already know we got to turn the volume all the way up. This is already going to creep me the fuck out. Press enter to start the game. All right, without further ado, let's hop right into this shit. Main story, alternate story. Uh, main story? How long is this game supposed to be? It was under the short category, so I can only imagine that's gonna be a little. This is very loud. <laughs> I'm not used to it being this loud. <laughs> All right, now let me turn it down a little bit. You know, they got to get the plugs in. Story told by Blue Title. Inspired by the short horror film by Michael Evans. AI made by Sven. Or Al? Is that AI? That's AI. That's AI. I've never been in the dark before like this. This is weird. <laughs> Some years ago, I lived in the center of a large city in the USA. As I have always been a night person, I often got bored after my roommate, who was decidedly not a night person, went to bed. To pass the time, I used to take long walks and spend time thinking. I spent four years like that, walking alone at night, and never once had a purse had a reason to feel afraid. I always used to joke with my roommate that even the drug dealers in the city were polite, but all that changed in just a few minutes of one evening. It was a Wednesday, somewhere between one and two in the morning, and I was walking near a police patrolled park quite a ways from my apartment. I was quiet it was a quiet night, even for a weeknight, with e with very little traffic and almost no one on foot. The park, as it was most nights, was completely empty. Cool. Sounds great. Now I myself, I really like creepy bosses. I used to listen to them when I was younger. Creeped me the fuck out. But uh, I'm a big boy now. I'm an adult. Wednesday, 2 a.m. Oh, can we change this mouse sensitivity, please? Can we, uh, can we do something about this mouse sensitivity? We cannot do anything about the mouse sensitivity. This is quite the neighborhood you live in. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I was about to say, I don't know what park has a fenced in gate like this, but you know, that could be literally any park. Ah, what a beautiful night. There's no moon, no stars, nobody walking. It's well lit though. We lit out here. It's lit. Oh, okay. After a long time of walking. 
Uh huh. It's been a long time. I'm tired. I better go home. What kind of New York? Oh, okay. It's just a car. No reason to be scared of a car. Cash register. Ah! Why does everything have to be so fucking loud? I'm very anxious. Why are the buildings so tall here? Do I live in New York City? I was walking down a small street to get back to my apartment when I first noticed it at the end of the street. There was a silhouette of a man in the distance. Bitch, where? Bitch, where? I'm not seeing a silhouette. I'm not seeing anybody yet. Where is said silhouette? Oh, there it is. <laughs> It was a strange dance. As he danced, he took a step forward. I guess you could say he was dancing, coming straight towards me. Hey, hey, look at the footwork. Hey, my man's getting gritty. Oh, none of y'all have footwork like this man right here. He's getting jiggy with it. He danced closer still until I could make out his face. His eyes were wide open and wild. Head tilted back, slightly looking off at the sky. His mouth was formed in a painfully wide cartoon of a smile. He got footwork and he knows how to dress? Damn! Let him take me out to dinner. Damn! I took my eyes off of him to cross the empty street. Oh, okay. Do I... I'm watching you. I don't care how good your footwork is. Oh, okay. He had stopped dancing and was standing with one foot on the street, perfectly parallel to me. He was facing me, but still looking uh, skyward. Smile still wide on his lips. He's just happy to see the moon. That isn't there. <laughs> okay. Okay. Don't take your eyes off of him. Don't take your eyes off of him until you can no longer see the silhouette of his body. He's right behind me, isn't he? He's right behind me, isn't he? He's right upon me. Ah! Oh. He had crossed the street and was now crouching slightly. I was so shocked. Damn! He looks like he is ready to sprint. I stood there for a while looking at him. I'm surprised at how stretchy those pants are. Them's his dress pants. You know damn well dress pants. He took giant exaggerated steps on tiptoe like a cartoon character sneaking up on someone only he was moving very very fast okay i think that's about time for us to you know get the fuck up out of here i think it's about time for us to get the fuck up out of here what you want big dog what the fuck do you want oh uh what the fuck do you want i didn't have an option to say anything else Oh, okay, he just wanted a hug. He just wanted somebody to talk to. And because we were rude about it, he just turned away and left. Okay. All right, cool. That's it, we're done. Ow! Ow! sprinting <laughs> my boy needed a running start oh my god he's moving ah! he's moving help no ow okay ow ow what the fuck oh i have to do this all over again bruh bruh At least the last game had an option for me to get back to where I was. Okay, I can't cross the street or anything. So what am I supposed to do? I, I think I just keep running. I think I just gotta keep moving. Don't look back. Don't even look back. Okay, I think I made it farther than I did last time. Is he still after me? I ran until I got off the side of the road and back onto a well-lit, low-traffic road. 
When I looked back, he was nowhere to be found. Throughout the rest of the way home, I kept looking over my shoulder, always expecting to see a stupid smile, but he never was there. I lived in that city for six months after that night and never went out for a night stroll again. There was something about his face that haunted me. He didn't look drunk. He didn't look high. He looked completely and utterly insane. And that's a very, very scary, scary thing to say. See. Okay. That was it! What the fuck? Alright, give me the alternate story. I want to see what the alternate story is like. I turned my lights off for this. Play alternate story. Do I play as the smiling man? One night I went to the market to buy something to eat. I do this a few times a week, not only to purchase food, but also to appreciate the nighttime tranquility. But this time was different. I came face to face with evil in the most sinister form. A tall, smiling, a tall man smiling and radiating a terrifying energy. I left a bit later than usual that night. It was 2 a.m. after that, or 2 a.m. After that night, I never went out again at that hour. I never went out again after that. Stayed in, became a shut-in. Go to the market. Oh my goodness. How much longer is this gonna be? <laughs> Ding dong! What? I can go behind the houses, but I can't go up to the door? That's some bullshit. Take me to the supermarket. Oh, hello. Hello, kind sir. You're a very handsomely dashing man. What a fucking weirdo. This is a long road. If I lived this far away from the gas station or wherever we're going, I would not walk. I would at least take a bike. At the very least, I would take a bike. Like, if you're going to go outside at night to enjoy some tranquility, some peace and quiet, take a bike. Don't walk. You're already running the risk of something terrible happening to you. Pick up something to buy. Okay, this is the second game where I find myself in a convenience store. View food to buy. Basic shopping list, special meal shopping list. Oh, oh, oh. Healthy shopping list. Snack shopping list. Barbecue shopping list. Oh. What is the cheapest? The cheapest is the basic shopping list. Milk, bread, eggs. Okay, that's a pretty healthy... That's a pretty healthy shopping list. So is this. You know, we're balling on a budget. We're going to get the basic shopping list. We're going to go with the basics. Balling on a budget tonight. What's good, gang? Good evening. It was 1350. Okay. I keep trying to press, like, enter in space. Go back home. Okay. Thank you for your services. Do you have a gun by chance that I could, like, borrow or something? Can I take your car back to my house? I stupidly decided to walk instead of, you know, ride a bike or something. I can't wait to get back and play some Among Us with my boys. I can't wait to play Fortnite with the homies. I can't wait to play Fall Guys with the lads. I don't even remember where my house is. I don't even remember which house is- ah! Okay, I'm running! I'm running! I'm running! What? Oh. 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 Door. Oh. The next night. What do you mean the next night? We're done! We're not going back to the store. After that, no thank you. Go to the market. Why? Why? Why are we doing this again? If I saw somebody creeping around my hedges, I, I'm moving out. I'm moving in with somebody, something, until I can get myself a new spot? No way in hell am I doing that. No. Oh, hi. Okay. This is where I run. This is where I run. What's good, gang? <laughs> We say the same thing as the last guy. What the fuck do you want? And then he's gonna turn around. He's gonna get himself a running start. And then we... Uh... I know your cheap tactics. I know your dirty tricks. I got your game in the bag.
takes us a little longer to look up than the last guy. And he's gonna run. We gotta run for it. Oh. What? Oh. That's different. Sir? Sir? No! Oh. Okay! Survive or die? Wait, what? Do I go back home? I feel like I should be going back home. What? Do I have to go to the market? Why would I? Why? Why? That's so fucking stupid. Why would I go to the market if I'm being chased by a... Ah! Am I supposed to have a weapon or something? Um... Uh, okay. That's different. Hey! Hey! Oh. 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 Did you have a gun back here by chance? Like, I'm not gonna say anything about this. I'm just gonna keep shopping. Um. I'm not gonna say anything. Nothing to say. Nothing to say, nothing to do. I'm just, I'm just shopping. Okay. Uh, okay. Ah! Motherfucker! I'm running! I'm running! I'm not even looking back. Oh! You're very well dressed! I love your suit! Is that Versace? Is that Calvin Klein? Do they make suits? <laughs> You're a bitch, you know that? You're a bitch! Fuck you! Oh, that's not my house. Fuck, that's not my house. Door! And then I never went outside ever again. Oh, he's just standing there. Menacingly! I liked that one better. I liked that story better. Good ending. That's the only ending I'm gonna get. I'm not, I'm not playing anymore. I'm done. I'm done. You can take your smiley man and shove him. Ah! Smiley man, my ass. I'm gonna cry. So that was three scary games. We played the smiling man, something in the well, and Tiki Tiki Moonlit Dread. Got it. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a like. Uh, I'm not expecting much, you know, maybe like one or two likes will do. Uh, if you guys want to get five, we could, we could strive for five. Bars, five likes just for the vibes. <laughs> if you're new here and you like the vibes and you like what I do and you've, you know, scrolled through and checked out some of my other videos, why not subscribe? It's free. Uh, you'd be joining the community. You'd be helping your boy out. I have a Resident Evil video here that you can check out. That was my last video. I... I'm gonna go take a nap. Drink a lot of water. Eat some breakfast. I'm, I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And... Big Buddy out!